Hello everyone, I wanted to do a quick video just talking about the back bevel and hard ups. Uh, if you have the latest update that was released around the same time as Box Cutter by accessing the sales page, it should also be in yours as well. To just show it off real quick, we're just going to draw a box, hold shift, and go in edit mode and just select a face. And by adding a bevel on a face in edit mode, we can now give it an entry bevel that you can adjust on the way in. Um, we're still working out how to get it integrated nicely into box cutter due to it flipping the normals and causing some uh, orientation issue on subsequent draws. But continuing on, we can also take the circle. And the reason that I'm showing it with box cutter is because box cutter just draws the shapes right on the surface. So it's just perfectly primed for a tool like this. So it always starts with one segment because once you start adding slopes, it begins to uh, you know, make the normals look a little strange. However, we can add a uh, weighted normal and that'll help things actually hold together. Um, another thing is in addition to that, if you use bevel with box like I am here and we hold shift to keep it live, uh, in order to add a bevel on top of this, I'll need to hold control whenever I click this to add an additional bevel modifier. And now we have this shape that has a back bevel in addition to a bevel going around the sides. But that was it. I just wanted to do a quick video uh, discussing this so that way um, I would be able to link users to it to give them more information. With that, I'll see you guys next time.